madness. Oh, what's the dude? David Bowen. Thank you very much. Uh, good evening. It was unexpected for me. I thought, you know, most old people know all about it. <laughs> they don't. And I'm just beginning to understand that. It's, it's, uh, it's strange. It's an interesting trip. It's really nice. I'm enjoying it a lot. Gorgeous girls about to meet. The talk of stars and kings and feet. Through the chromosomes of space and time. Beyond fast like that infection. Gasping for my resurrection. Swear to me in times of war and stress. I'm telling lies. Just I wanted telling to be very lies. actively participating in it. And so I invited my guests to work along with me if they would care to. Um, and I was very fortunate in, in that uh, they all said yes. So uh, it's, it's a bit of, it's more of, a, uh, more of a, a, a dream concert for me. It's like one, it's like I sat down and said, what would be a really cool show to do? And I just wrote names down that I really like. And I phoned them up. Some of them have absolutely nothing to do with me. But I thought, well, you know, only 50 ones have a go at it. And, uh, and they were great. They were just terrific. I've got the cheek of the devil, though. I'd like to present Robert Smith. <laughs> It doesn't seem like he's 50, actually. And it's kind of like a... It's a weird thing. With a lot of people that that, that do things creatively, age... I mean, despite what you, you're led to believe by the popular press, particularly the music press, age isn't really that important, you know? I mean, it is if you're going to, like, look a certain way and, like, do certain things, and it's driven home, you know, that you're, you're too fat or something like that. It's, it becomes an image problem. But I think, mentally, he's probably, like... 15 and 100. One, two, three, four. 